welcome back to Brenda's Kitchen and More, guys. Look at that. I am going to a church event. Um, I'm supposed to be wearing a piggy's hat. <laughs> I went for a Starbucks because we have already decorated. I'm going to show you guys how we decorated our little spot for El Dia de los Niños, guys. Yeah, it's going to be super fun and exciting. Oh my God. I'm going to try to record in here as much as I can for you guys. Look like at your friend over here. With her shoes all cute every day. <laughs> Hi, thank you. Welcome, welcome. We're having a great day. Hello. <laughs> Get your partner, get your partner. Meet your kids. Thank you. Oh, thank you. Bobby Pins. Bobby Pins. Thank you, thank you. Because of the air, huh? Yeah, like, no se me queda. See how it goes. I'm going to try to put on mine. <laughs> Hi. Hello. Hello. Yeah, today, uh, yeah, today we're gonna do it outside. Okay. Hey, this is our little spot. Mm -hmm. This is our little spot. All these little. We can have fun. Let me show you guys everything. Hold on. people well your friend is back already from service now i gotta see what i'm gonna make to eat <clears throat> i think i'm gonna rest for a little bit because it was a long day but it was so much fun it was a big blessing you know my grandkids my daughter everybody you know everybody had a, a good good time and that's that's all that it really matters but yeah guys it was it was amazing it was so much fun <laughs> it's well worth everything you know but but yeah guys okay your friend i know i should do cook something i will show you but if not guys i'm gonna change into something else more comfortable i am so tired i want to change already but i don't know yet let's see <laughs> um i don't know what Let's see. Let's see what I start cooking. What I could do. Yeah. And I am going to be showing you guys in the video from yesterday, I believe. Um, I showed you guys I went grocery shopping and I bought some little costillitas like ribs. And I'm going to make them with cactus and a red sauce, guys. So I'm going to be showing you guys how I do my red sauce. And I'm going to be showing you 
what I'm doing to my my ribs or the meat I'm gonna show you guys real quick first of all I'm already cutting my cactus my nopales like it I'm cutting them small I boiled some eggs my son loves boiled eggs just like his grandma I love boiled eggs guys and over here look at this I already have my meat frying it up a little bit I have it covered so it can get soft and tender and yeah guys look at the look at the it looks super delicious it's so delicious and then and if you guys see the the video before this one I did um I left them marinating all night with salt, pepper, garlic powder, onion powder, and um, what else did I put in there? I know I put something else. No, on these I think I just added garlic powder, onion powder, salt, pepper. Yeah, that's what I did. But look at. So I'm gonna make my. I'm gonna get my chiles and I'm gonna show you guys. Okay, here guys, I got my nopales. I added half of a, a small sliced onion. And then I'm going to add these garlic cloves. And um, I'm going to add some salt. That is it. Ooh. I want to say it's like about a tablespoon and a half. Or a teaspoon and a half, sorry. Or a full tablespoon. Yeah, I'm going to let it boil up, cook them up. And I'm gonna start making my salsa. Let me show you guys. Okay, guys, look at I got 12 chiles. Some of these uh, chili pods, um, they're the um, guajillo. And then I have that other half of the onion. I got four garlic cloves. I have one tablespoon, no, sorry, guys, one teaspoon of, um, I added. See if you guys can see. See if we focus. Black garlic paste it is, guys. And then I am gonna add two bay leaves, some pepper, some cumin, cumin, cumin. If you focus. And then I hear I have some beef bouillon, guys. This, I got it in Mexico. That's why it's in a bag. <laughs> yeah, and okay. that's how much I'm going to add. I'm going to add it into there. Okay. The cumin, guys. Oh, two taste. Oh, yes. It's not coming out. Lushy. Then we're going to have to... Okay, guys, that's how much of the cumin. That's that much. Okay. Black pepper. It's about the same. Look at as much as you think. Mm. Let's get our bay leaves. There you go. Two bay leaves, guys. And then here I have a full cup of water right here. I'm going to add it to that. Oh, guys, I forgot to add. I'm going to add um, two tomatoes. Actually, I'm just going to add one. One tomato. And that is it. I'm going to blend it up. Oh, you know what? I forgot to put the salt. But I'm not going to add too much because you know that the beef bouillon does have... Um, Salt, so that's much I'm gonna add to it. Then I'll taste it. If I know it needs more, then I'll add more. You know what, guys? I'm gonna add some of this. This is chipotle powder. Okay, if I'm right. Yep, chipotle. So I'm gonna add a little bit so I can give it some spice and some good flavor. A little bit more. And I'm going to blend it up. I'm going to taste it and I'll let you know. Okay, guys, right here I already took out my meat. And over here I made my sauce already. 
I'm gonna throw it in my skillet, fry it up a little bit, toast it up. Let me see. Just a little bit. Mmm, it's gonna be delicious. Yeah, baby. And I'm gonna strain it right into. I'm gonna strain it right into the pan. Use all those juices and everything. cook it up for a little bit guys i'm gonna strain it cook it up for a little bit and then i'm gonna add my meat back in and then my cactus my nopales and it's gonna be ready and i'm gonna make a mexican cauliflower rice on the side with it okay guys once i'm gonna put the meat in i'll show you guys Guys, I did open a um, tomato paste and I added this much more water because I still had like the bits and crumbs of the chile. And I did add half a tablespoon of beef bouillon more. Okay, guys. Still got my sauce right over there. Okay, Look, guys, okay. my sauce is so delicious. I already tried it. I'm going to let it boil a little bit more because I did not boil the chiles before. Some people do. Sometimes I do do that, but sometimes I don't. I just throw it in the pan, fry it, let it boil, take off that all this that you see. I'll take it off till it's clear. Then I'll add my meat, guys, which I have it right there. Those are sausages from earlier. <laughs> okay guys I'm gonna start adding the meat to my sauce and then my um, nopales yes you can be I'm, I'm cooking nanny's cooking right now okay you play with two cats make this to make these cats get this go you could you go do that okay Okay, guys. Boy, with this boy. Okay, guys. The meat is in. But you put the shake in. Mm, the sauce is so delicious. Shake it, Dawa. Look at it. Shake. Ooh, my wall. I'll get it right there. Okay. Put some sauce all over it. And I'm gonna add some nopalitos. I'm gonna add them already, guys. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, I'm gonna take out the onion and the garlic out of the nopales. there it is I'm gonna cover it up for at least 15 20 more minutes on very low 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 fire look at him. it's pretty low Just let it boil up a little bit and it'll be ready look guys the boiled eggs that I did for my um 
Well, for me and my grandson, but they get haunted missions, they look so creamy. <laughs> and over here, look at, I have the cauliflower rice. I had I had it here straining, but um, I kind of squeezed it a little bit, so I just have it under that. I'm gonna use it to um, stir fry that, and I'm also gonna use some of that tomato paste over there. That's my coffee. I'm gonna chop up some garlic and that is going to be my Mexican rice guys mm -mm -mm. oh right here you guys will see in another video I'm going to use it up already because it's uh, chili what do they have the peppers uh, uh, garlic, onion zucchini and the little green onions that's what that has in there guys it's a mixture i i fried it up all of it and um i added some to my lasagna no it was not a lasagna that meatloaf so now i'm gonna when i fry this up well i'm gonna put some oil fry that up put some of that fry it up you guys i'll, I'll show you Let's see. Okay, here I got my pan. Super, super hot. Very hot. Very, very hot. Okay, so there it is. Some avocado oil. Let me open it up because I forgot. To. Okay, some avocado oil. Just some of that. Maybe, I'm going to say like two tablespoons. I don't know, guys. But I'm going to add my rice. If I'm doing regular rice. Ooh. Okay. Okay, let me get a sap. Oh, hi. So unprepared, I'm telling you guys. <laughs> I added two pinches of salt and some garlic salt right there. As much as you guys like. Some pepper. And some onion powder, guys. Okay. Okay, guys, right there. I already added that. You would want to call it like, I guess a sofrito, I would want to say. But, I don't know. Whatever you guys want to call it, it's frying up a little bit in the middle. And then I'm going to mix it in. And then I'm going to put the tomato paste in the middle. Let it fry up a little bit. I'll show you. You guys, everything's mixed in right here already. Um, I added the tomato paste right there. I'm going to fry it up a little bit. Just like that. Probably add a little bit of water, but that's it. I'm not going to add no more oil or anything. The rice, as you can see, it's... Well, the cauliflower rice, it's um, fried up real good. So, I'm just going to do that. Yep. Yeah. Sorry, guys. <laughs> okay guys right there look at I added about a half a cup of water I'm and now I'm gonna mix it all in okay oh thanks okay guys right there look at I added about a half a cup of Don't forget to hit that bell to get notified every time I upload a video. Bye guys. See you guys in another video. Bye guys.